A Bangor nonprofit is working to provide housing for those who are impacted by homelessness, and they're taking it to the next level. Logan Hoffman shows us how. Come on in. This is our model apartment building. Robin Sandow is the president of Designwell Housing. Her husband, Jonathan, is the vice president. The nonprofit purchased this home on Smith Street Avenue in Bangor last year. They're renovating it into two apartments. This will be a three bedroom down here, a three bedroom unit. Um, not two smaller bedrooms, but smaller bedrooms. And then upstairs we have a, a two bedroom. But it goes beyond housing. How could an individual get a job without being able to have clean clothes? Um, and I truly believe that people are kind of like fish. They grow to their environment. So if you give them room to spread out, then they may find, you know, they may find their purpose. And that's what it's all about. Once the lease is signed, the help doesn't stop there. What our volunteers will do is come in every day, make contact with the individuals that live with us and see if there's any gaps and if we can fill them. They hope to finish unit one by the end of the summer, but they need the community's help. If we all just do one thing together, this will be such a beautiful community project and something that will change the face of homelessness in the Bangor area. You can help in a variety of ways, from trade skills to just visiting. But what they really need is an arborist. This yard is a mess, and I need somebody to come cut the branches down here. And It's actually what ruined this house in the first place, and we'd love to have somebody come down and take care of that. We really understand that we are not going to be able to house everyone. But if we can start with one building, one unit at a time, and help people benefit themselves, then it's all going to be worth it. Logan Hoffman, WABI, TV5 News, Bangor.